in a similar development, an Embassy government is inaugurated a steering committee for the Nigeria for Women Program Scale Up, NFWPSU, a federal government social investment program aimed at leaving, lifting Nigerian women out of poverty. Governor Saludo inaugurated the committee, which is one of the requirements for a state to qualify for the Nigeria for Women Program Scale Up at the Government House, OCA. Again, Government House correspondent Emmanuel Okonkwa's report is taken from our studio. The other one is also the, the Nigerian Women Program Scale Up. It's the United States 500 million naira credit to the federal government for an eight years national women empowerment program to support women with improved livelihood opportunities in targeted communities. The project is designed to develop and strengthen new and existing women affinity groups with strong livelihood to enhance household income. Inaugurating the groups, the Anambra state governor, represented by his deputy, Dr. Nyeka Chufu Ibezim, encouraged them to bring their expertise to bear and work to ensure that the primary objective of the program, which is to lift women out of poverty, is actualized at the end. The government actually wants to make Anambra a destination for a multi-impartial state. Where people will come and say yes, not, not just I'm passing through Anambra and leaving Anambra to other areas, but where people will train to come to Anambra to live, learn, invest, work, relax, and enjoy. The governor, when he inaugurates our committee, he doesn't congratulate. He says, I congratulate with you because this is a prior call to work. Help us achieve our vision. Speaking on behalf of others, the chairman of the committee and commissioner for budget and economic planning, Mrs. Chiamaka Nake, represented by the Permanent Secretary in the Ministry, Dr. Stephanie Kelly Uzo, promised to render selfless service to the state through the opportunity given to them to serve in the Anambra. I want to say a big thank you to Mr. Deputy Governor for the inauguration. Mr. Governor has always been passionate about women and vulnerable people. And today we have a program that is addressing issues relating to women and vulnerable people. I want to say that this quality will be up and doing and is ready to take all it takes to do the job. The committee has Commissioner for Economic Planning and Budget, Mrs. Chiamaka Nake, as its chairperson. The coordinator, State Operations Coordinating Unit, Mrs. Nkole Anyebunam, as the secretary. Commissioner for Education, Professor Ngozi Chumude, that of Women Affairs, Lady Ifi Obinabo, Foster Ihejo of Agricultural Ministry, and that of Health, Dr. Afam Obidike, Commissioner for Finance, Commissioner for Power and Water Resources, and Commissioner for Justice are members of the committee.